So 90% of people I know own Glocks, but this isn't just a Glock. This is a Umarix 17 Gen 5, meaning it's a reputable brand. This thing is meant to be a decent replica. So let's crack it open and see how it looks. Big shout out to JK Army. Make sure to check out the link down below to see their products. They've got a great range of airsoft products and loads of other accessories, including this Glock here. But let's get on with the review. Nice, this thing looks awesome already. I believe with this particular model, there's an easy scope fitting mechanism, so we'll see how that works shortly. But in the packet, we get some plates. Nice weighty magazine. So this is obviously gonna hold your gas. The 17 Gen 5 itself, already feeling lovely and sturdy. Metal parts on there, but got your polymer as well. So this thing's gonna be really, really lifelike. And yeah, I'm looking forward to trying that. So the pistol has got everything that you'd expect on the Glocks got all the markings on there, the official sort of markings, and it's packed full of the features that you expect. Trigger has the safety built into it. Iron sights along the top with the quick release mechanism here to be able to fit your scopes, which I'll show you shortly. And this particular model has a really easy spring change system as well as being able to adjust the hop up. So if you squeeze these two little catches at the side here and push this mechanism forwards, You can see the whole thing comes apart and within there, you've got the spring and also the hop-up wheel here. Able to rapidly pop that back on to get you back into action. Even novices like myself at taking these things apart can manage that. Finally, you slide her along the top, which you can hold open and release with the little catch here. Your magazine fill can easily be accessed by pulling down this little lever and then lifting this thing forwards, which is just there. The magazine's then got space for 18 BBs, easily loaded by pulling the spring down and loading into here. Leaving you ready to lock and load, release that hatch, and then fire your BBs. Yeah, you can't get simpler than that, and this thing feels great. Within your manual, it should tell you what base plate you need for your pistols. Now, I fitted one already here, which just needed two screws easily fitted on here when you remove the existing base plate. Then really simple and straightforward, you can insert your red dot straight onto the plate, and you can insert your two screws into the top just here. Well, like I said, a lot of people own Glocks, but this thing just takes it to the next level, really. The recoil on there is brilliant. The kickback and the blowback from the system of the gas. Yeah, it's really realistic, especially for an airsoft gun. This thing is really cool. What I really like is the grip itself. It's so grippy with these little grooves here. Your hand's not slipping around when you're firing and it's got a really nice grip on here. So your hand's not slipping anyway. It's quite a nice long length, replica sort of size. And yeah, there's not really much bad things to say about this thing, to be fair. That combined with the quick release of the top piece here, just makes this thing a real doddle for any beginner even player to sort of get your hands on. It's not gonna cause you any issues. And yeah, adjusting that hop up just seems really simple and straightforward as well. If you wanna pick one of these up, make sure to visit JK Army. That's where this thing came from. Got a great selection, like I say. But make sure to like and subscribe as well. We'll be back with loads more reviews. Thanks for watching. Make sure to see you guys soon.